Hello with your CID TV News update this Tuesday. I'm Donna Bush wishing you a wonderful 2017. 34 Cuban migrants landed in Cayman Brac over the holiday weekend. They were since transferred to Grand Cayman on Thursday, the 29th of December. Now, the Department of Immigration, with the assistance of other law enforcement agencies, also sent home 19 migrants to Cuba on the same day. Currently, there are 85 Cuban migrants in Grand Cayman awaiting repatriation. They're housed at the Immigration Detention Center or other approved facilities on island. Meantime, after spending more than three weeks in Washington, D.C., leading up to the 2016 Miss World pageant, Ms. Cayman Monique Rochelle Brooks arrived home to a hearty welcome just days before Christmas. 117 world beauties took part in the competition on Sunday, the 18th of December at the MGM National Harbor in Oxon Hill, Maryland. Now, fellow Caribbean contestant from Puerto Rico, Stephanie Davila, took the crown while another regional beauty from the Dominican Republic bagged first runner-up. Ministry of Tourism staffer Mrs. Uh, Judy Powery lauded uh, Ms. Brooks for her showing at Miss World. Ms. Powery commented she did the Cayman Islands proud and we're very happy to welcome her back home. Accompanying Miss Cayman Islands from Miami on a Cayman Airways flight were the Miss Cayman Committee Chairperson, Miss Derry Lee, and Chief of Protocol and Committee Member, Miss Melanie Sims. Well, Acting Deputy Collections Collectors, rather, Mr. Kevin Walton and Mr. Jeff Jackson have been promoted to Deputy Collectors in the Customs Department that was effective the 1st of January. Head of Customs, Mr. Charles Clifford, says the promotions are an important development in the progression of the Department's succession plan. Succession planning, he said, in an organization the size of Customs is never about one person or post, but rather about the short, medium, and long-term plan for the entire organization, which by its very nature must include all officers. In that regard, he added, we anticipate additional promotions to various ranks in the near term. Both officers have substantial experience in the customs management uh, area. Deputy Collector Walton, with nearly 30 years experience with the department, has risen from the ranks uh, to the, his present position with a diploma in executive customs management from the University of Canberra. In collaboration with the Caribbean Customs Law Enforcement Council, Mr. Walton is currently pursuing a Bachelor of Science degree in Business Administration at the International College of the Cayman Islands. Meanwhile, Deputy Collector Jackson, who joined the department as a customs officer 31 years ago, moved up the ranks to his present position. He continues to build his career through further learning opportunities and has obtained an executive certificate in global leadership. Mr. Jackson is currently pursuing a master's degree in business administration. As always, if you missed today's news update, you can get all the details on our Facebook page as well as our YouTube channel. Also, don't forget to tune into Radio Cayman's For the Record and talk today's shows. For now, I'm Donna Bush as always wishing you a wonderful and of course a very safe night and I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye for now.